Ever wondered what happens during colorectal cancer surgery? Let's take a look. Colorectal cancer surgery focuses on removing cancerous sections of the colon or rectum. The goal is to get rid of the tumor and some nearby tissue to prevent the cancer from spreading. This surgery can be done using either open surgery, where a large incision is made in the abdomen, or minimally invasive techniques, like laparoscopy, which uses small incisions and a camera. In laparoscopic surgery, small instruments are inserted through the tiny cuts, and the surgeon uses a camera to guide them. This means faster recovery and less scarring. Next, the surgeon removes the section of the colon or rectum containing the cancer, along with nearby lymph nodes, which are tested to see if the cancer has spread. If possible, the healthy ends of the colon or rectum are reconnected in a procedure called an anastomosis. This allows normal bowel function to continue. In some cases, a temporary or permanent stoma is created, where part of the intestine is connected to an opening in the abdomen, allowing waste to exit the body through a bag. After surgery, recovery time can vary. Many patients resume normal activities in weeks, but it depends on the complexity of the surgery.